Boys, I feel like I've made this topic a video like twice now. I might actually be getting sick of it, but you guys seem to like these videos, so I'll do it again for you. Anyways, in Anime Dimensions, there are many different characters that players can play as and use. Some characters are only obtainable in the boss raid, others in the boss rush, and some only from limited events. But a lot of those characters are either really expensive or annoyingly hard to get. So in this video, I'll be sharing with you the three best gem characters one can get for free or from the shop. But real quick, here's a quick shout out to my members. Also join the Discord, link in the description down below. Thanks cuties, I mean cuties, I mean cuties. Okay, the first character we're gonna talk about is Artoria Pendragon from the Fate series. She's a character that's obtainable from the gem shop for 1600 gems and also has an awakening that gives her a fifth ability and a 12% damage buff when she's used as an assist. Saber, or Artoria Pendragon's abilities are Cross Slash, Flying Slice, Mana Burst, Stellar Beam, and Divine Construct. This character is going to be the most expensive out of all of them due to the method on how she is obtained. The thing isn't terribly expensive due to it only being 2,000 gems. But with another 1,600 added on top of the cost to get her, it's a bit much. 3,600 gems will take just a smidgen bit of grinding. So if you want this character, save up for that. Next up is Rimuru. Rimuru Tempest is the main protagonist from the anime Tenshura, or that time I got reincarnated as a slime if you prefer, if you prefer that, and is a character one can obtain from the gem shop for 1,600 gems, or alternatively, for free as a drop from the nightmare difficulty in the slime dimension. Rimuru's abilities are Black Lightning, Gluttony, Flare, Twilight, and Giga Demon Blaze. As I just mentioned, Rimuru is obtainable from a dimension for absolutely free. This is nice since you can save your gems up for both Artoria and this character's awakenings. Rimuru does have a low drop rate in the dimension, so just be prepared to be spending a bit of time farming the slime dimension in effort of trying to drop them. And the final character is Power. Power is a character from the anime and manga Chainsaw Man, and is a character one can obtain from the shop for 1600 gems, and is also droppable in the devil dimension. Now it might be a bit of a surprise to see this character here, but Power is an insanely powerful character. Don't worry, I regret nothing. Even though she's a gem character. She doesn't have an awakening, but that is not going to stop the fact that she is really good at damage. So you're going to want to use her as a main. Okay, that's the team, but real quick. If this video has helped you out, then make sure to not only like it, but also subscribe for more. Currently, I'm trying to hit 100,000 subscribers before the year 2024 ends, so all support is appreciated. So, with this team, you're going to be able to do some good damage and be able to progress in the game, both in the raid mode and also in dimensions. But keep in mind that characters can only do so much. You need to be worrying about your stats more than anything. So, if you're new to Anime Dimensions, then make sure to go watch this video right here. It's a tips video that will help you out a lot in the game. So go watch it by clicking on it right here. Dismissed!